Hey guys, what is going on? Welcome to another update here in Fortnite. It is the version 14.20 update and it brings with it eh, not very much at all. There is a nice game mode called Marvel Takeover. Team up, use your superpowers to capture and defend outposts in a mighty battle for control of the island. Sounds pretty fun to me. Sign me up. We are going to jump into it right here, right now. Um, what else has the update brought? We should be having Fortnite third birthday coming soon for Battle Royale, that is. Not Save the World, considering they have already celebrated it in July. Um, what else should we be having? There's been a nod to Blade. There's been uh, Wolverine put in Weeping Woods. They've prepared for BTS. There's the Midas Fish. There's the Punch card for completing the fishing collection. And uh, they've got ready for uh, Rocket League. That's about it. Pretty boring update, if you ask me. However, this game mode sounds absolutely gorgeous. So you got to capture reactors. So this is basically like a... Uh, What's it called? It's almost like a game of hard point. Like you've got to capture and control the uh, points. Oh wow! I did a I did a quick challenge by spawning in. It's not it's not exactly disco domination though. This is like this is going to be a more fun than disco dom. Yo, those are actually launch pads on the side of them as well. Yeah, this is like this is more like a game of hardpoint than it's than it is like a uh, disco dom. Capturing reactor B. Yeah, woohoo! You actually get a lot of XP for capturing a reactor as well. 650 XP, who could hate that? Reactor D is now live. A is fading in the storm. Enemy captured reactor C. Choose respawn location. What? Right, I'm going for reactor E. Capturing reactor. 650 XP if you capture a reactor as well. That is gorgeous to see. This is quite a fun game mode as well. Captured. Someone probably needs to go for D. Ooh. Hence why I'm bailing. Down towards F. Or what or where will be F? C's fading out in the storm now. Enemy may have captured E, but we're gonna get F first. That's the way I see it. Yeah. Right, we've captured C, so we are get, we're also getting progress. No, they've got D and D. Right, F should literally be visible any second now. Yeah, it is. Ouch! 
I just kind of set fire to myself. That was not clever. Right, let's take F. Cannot capture F yet because we've got to get the storm's got to go past it. Right, let's fly over to G now. Capturing reactor G. By the way, the more people you've got capturing, the quicker it captures. E's fading out in the storm. That's good to see because if that one disappears, then um, obviously they're not getting points from it. No, they're taking F. Yeah, go for F. We need to try not to let them get either of them, if possible. Yeah, and they've got G. They've got they've got the they got the triple there. They got the triple off for a second. Oh, the spawn location. You can choose to spawn where a teammate is. Or in the centre of the circle. So I've just spawned where you were, Liam. That's quite useful to know. Nah, they have really got F and G on lock here. I can't get off the map. I'm stuck on the map. Ah, there we go. I will spawn with Liam. Down at F. Yeah, we are taking F. The only thing is, is F won't be in the circle as long as G will. Right, we need to take... Right, we're taking G, which is what we need. We need to not focus on F now. We need we need to get G, and then we need to go and get H, I, and J. I would. Why is there a flaming hoop next to Salty now? Oh no, the flaming the flaming hoop disappeared. Yeah, that's almost definitely a challenge. There's like a ramp to jump off as well. Alright, let's cat let's lock down H. I'm locking down H right now. And then I'm gonna go straight over to I. I dunno. Because um, they're actually trying to take H. No, they're taking H. This is this is ridiculous. I do like how you can choose where you spawn in though. I'm gonna spawn in the centre I'm gonna spawn in the centre of the circle and go for uh this power here, whatever this one is. That's Venom's smash and grab. And then I'll go up on J.
and we're taking Jay. Next ones are going to be spawning in any second. Great, they've already got K. They're doing what we were doing. I'm going for L then. Basically, what the only way we win here is by holding all three reactors. Uh, it's not going to happen. Pretty sure we have lost this. Which is a shame. Cannot capture L. Capturing L. Ninety nine per cent, and that'll be the hundred. There we go. To be fair, that gives a really good amount of XP, though, as well. Because you got a lot of XP for kills, you get it's basically Team Rumble XP plus six fifty every time you capture a reactor. Now we got to what was the last letter L? So that's A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L. It's 12 reactors. That's a potential of 7,500 XP, roughly. Like, play this game about 10 times and you're probably going to get a level up. Guaranteed. All in all, it's a fun game mode as well. Like, that's a game mode that lasted, what, 12 minutes. Got really good XP. Had quite a bit of fun doing it. I could I could sit there and play that again quite a lot of times now. So, all in all, despite the update being pretty small, I quite enjoyed that game mode. So, with that in mind, people, thanks for watching the video. Hope you found it informative, enjoyable, and fun to watch. It was definitely fun to play. With that in mind, goodbye.